Hi all, welcome to another episode of Kamal Tech Vlog. In today's episode, what we are going to do is we are going to unbox a very, 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 very cheap TWS earphones and we are going to check how it actually works. So let's start with that. Okay guys, so this is the TWS earphones which I'm talking about. It's called as V Cool. You can see this. It's called the Cool Moonwalk Mini, and <laughs> this is how it came. There was no seal, nothing on it. So let's open and see what is there in that. Okay. So you have a pair of earbuds over here. Extra earbuds. You have. A I'm not wrong. It's let me see. Okay, and you have the earbuds here in the front side, apart from the box, and you have a charging cable. I'm not sure. Yeah, it's micro USB, I think so. I'm not sure about it. Let me check. Okay, this is a micro USB cable. I'm not wrong. Let me check with a micro USB or the Type C. I didn't even notice that. Too. So let me try fixing this. Yeah, I'm dead sure. This is a micro USB. These both are both are same cable. Yeah. Okay. So. This is the box, charging box. It says it has indicator and everything in it, but there is no charge in it. I'm not sure about it. These are the headphones. Looks like a plastic box. That's it. There's nothing to it. And these looks like plastic headphones. <laughs> what can you expect? It's just for 649 or 659 rupees. So let me just fix this in the case and see how it looks. Okay. So this is how it looks when it's charging. It has a charge indicator also by which you can see that it's charging over here to what percentage. So let the headphones be there. So uh, this says two wireless earbuds. Be cool. It's a local quality thing. It looks right. It's one thousand nine ninety nine over here, but it's not that much. So it has five point two Bluetooth over here. IPX five splash proof. Ten meter range. Magnetic charging. Standby one twenty hours. Micro charging port. Uh, it doesn't, and one year warranty is there. That's the only thing. One charge, one one micro USB cable, one manual. So that's the package. For six fifty nine, what else can we expect? So let's go ahead and okay. It started flashing automatically. So we'll just use the right bud now. I'm just going ahead and turning on my Bluetooth. Moonwalk Mini. It has picked up. It is connected. This one. So let's go to the main cam over here because we don't see anything much for unboxing over here. So let's go to the main cam. Okay guys, so this is the Moonwalk Mini which I showed you. Let me just fix this on to my ear. The only reason I got this was because I wanted a smaller headphone than my Bolt which I'll be comparing with this. But let me see how the music is over here. Let's play an NPS track. Okay, it has 90% battery. Okay, I'm 
just playing an NCS track over here to just check how good this is. Okay, I've just played the Mucius track. It can't go ahead and take treble or anything much, but it gives a good effect of music. Not as good as uh, any of the expensive headsets. It's like as if you're sitting in a bathroom and listening to music inside this. Maybe it's just because I have only one of the headsets on. So let me try with the other headset also on inside. Let me. Okay, I'm just going ahead and putting it into a dual mode. Okay. I this is connecting, so let me see that. Okay, what I can see over here is if you just take the mono pad over here, it sounds like bathroom noise, which is sweet. Inside a closed echoing sound comes, but if you put both the headphones together, it is as good as a JBL one. So not at all bad. For six fifty nine, you're getting a headset like this together. Separately it's not good, but together it has a very good sound. So the sound test has gone good now. It is working well. Let me just go ahead and try calling a toll free atel number or any number just to check. Okay, I just called a customer care number and I will to hear very clearly. Now, the biggest test of all for which I bought this headphone, it is very, very simple. I wanted to see if this headphone can pass my normal test where I can go ahead and put this, wear it inside a helmet. If this works, that is the best thing which we can do. So we are going to try that out now on this video. Because I want a small headset which can go inside the helmet. Because I had every TWS, like Bolt Audio and all, that's kind of big. So let me get my helmet and just get back to you now. Okay guys, I am back over here. It would sound a little bit weird because I am just going to try checking this with my helmet whether it works. Because most of the people have the problem with the helmet. They don't get a small enough headset for that. They have to put a wire headset or anything like that. So let me try with both the headset whether it works. Or even at least one of them is more than enough for Google Maps or anything while you're riding your bike or something like that. So let me try this. It would sound weird but this is the first tech wave review I'm doing with an helmet over here. Okay, with both the headset, there is an issue, it's kind of big, so let's try with one of them. I don't know my hat got spoiled, but not a problem. We do have to test this, because my only purpose of buying a cheap headset was to buy it inside the helmet, because I do have better headset than this. Oh wow, it works. So let me just play a track inside this. 
and check this out because many people many of the riders have this problem mainly if you go for a long ride or anything the one problem everyone faces is how to go ahead and get a helmet a headset for a helmet that is so let me see the song okay there's no pain there's nothing inside the helmet and it's a1 even i can put the band also so we are obeying all the rules over there so this has served the purpose of getting purchased okay i just lost it it's so tiny over here in my hand as you can see so it is working within the helmet so when you're riding a bike or even riding a car if i put this inside my ear as you can see my ear is not that big but it's not even visible because i have seen i've been searching for a headset which is invisible for a long time for this because it has to be small enough and most of them are professional grade and they cost a lot starting about 34000 45000 which just go inside the ear but this is one of the smallest headsets as you see my face straight oh the only if i turn it this side you know a headset is there if i keep my head straight you don't even know i have a headset over here i can also use it for my recording of the videos to go ahead and hear myself so and the range is very good it's 10 meters range in this so if you're looking out for a hell like a headset at cheap price you could go for this 659 is nothing for a casual listening to music it's good and as it says on the box it has about four to five hours of listening time standby is 120 hours so that's mostly what we need over here in a single charge about five hours of listening time or talk time is more than enough then you can just put it inside the box and if you have any usb cable like a and a usb port you can go ahead and put this for charge the rest of the time that's what i'm going to do now i'm just going to go ahead and put this for charge till i finish the video over here and this will be charging automatically and once it's completely charged the box uh, the charging box will be charged i can go ahead and charge it at least two three times more in that just like bolt audio what we'll be doing is we'll be doing a comparison between this and bolt audio also in my next video but for now that's all i have got if you did like this video because it was a crazy video because for what i had bad the headset would be a totally different scenario in your case if you want a tiny headset this is well and good you can go with it it doesn't sound that bad unless we meet next time if you did like the video as i told you please do like and subscribe for the channel and you're watching kamal tech vlog and my name is kamal and you have a wonderful day ahead